And you need some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted. Make sure to check out my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and the most reliable coins on the market right now. Make sure to head over to Buy Madden Coins and use code Poodle at checkout for 20% off your order. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today we got some pretty cool stuff. We got the new golden tickets in game, of course. And then we have the NFL draft expansion. So the draft expansion is pretty self explanatory. You guys are all asking why there are no more second rounders, why there are no third rounders in the game. Pretty much the draft expansion is adding rounds two and maybe even a little bit of third because they did say 40 players. Now I took screenshots of some of the first like 10 ones that they did release because I don't want to go, I don't want to show you guys 40 screenshots of low 90 players. I'm sure you guys the bulk of them. They will be dropping in game tomorrow, but we were given some stats now. And I'm sure you guys some of those screenshots. And we also have golden tickets today. Now, guys, servers might be down for you guys. Servers are kind of being glitchy for everyone right about now. I'm in, but Kralo, the community manager, wasn't in. So if he can't get in, I imagine a lot of people probably can't get in, but I'm in. So I'm chilling here. But we got some golden tickets. So today we got Maze. We got the new Lamar Jackson, which I'm super hyped for. Might actually even buy that if I can get some coins up for that. And he's affordable. And we got Trey Edmonds. And we got the NFL Drafts expansion to talk about. So let's head on over to these screenshots in just a second. But guys. Before we get into today's video, make sure down below, hit that subscribe button, turn that notification bell, boys, come join the family. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up, as always, and if you haven't already, comment down below. Let me know what you think of these golden tickets, and are you excited for the draft expansion? All you guys who are fans of teams out there, going to be getting your second round stars tomorrow, so hopefully you guys enjoy them. So a few in there, like Grant Delpit, uh, T. Higgins, a few cool ones in there, uh, Xavier McKinney, pretty decent stats on them. Let's go check out all the screenshots and see all the stats. Alright guys, so first golden ticket we have up here is Taylor Mays. Now this Taylor Mays looks absolutely insane 99 overall strong safety cincinnati Bengals. so he's at 98 speed 98 excel 96 tackle 95 play rec 99 pursuit 98 man coverage 95 zone coverage as well as 99 hit power this card is going to be the ultimate safety now with cams and everything he's gonna end up with 99 zone coverage more than likely you get locked down on him and john madden he's gonna end up with sprinters he's gonna end up with 99 speed 99 excel he's going to end up getting uh maxed out he's gonna end up with like a 92 93 man Gonna end up with maxed out pursuit, maxed out play recognition, and close to like a 97 tackle or 98 tackle. This card's gonna be pretty much the best at everything. Six foot three, gonna be a great user card, like an amazing user safety, as well as just leave him by himself. He can do everything, guys. Probably gonna have a great catch, gonna have a great strength, and then get enforcer, probably gonna get zoned out or universal coverage. Doesn't really matter. This guy's going to be phenomenal. Highly recommend if you somehow can get your hands on him. You hold him tight and dear to your heart because he's going to be great to be playing with now i don't know when these guys will be up again with the servers being down they might not even be up yet uh next lamar jackson now, this is the guy that i'm most excited for going to be the best quarterback in madden they're gonna be the he's gonna be the the quarterback like that's it he's, he's, he's maxed out so let's see with sprinter he's ended up at 99 speed and then with john madden passing and go deep let's just say with john madden passing go deep he'll end up with a 99 throw power a 99 throw deep 98 throw mid and 98 throw short and then 99 everything else or you can go West Coast on him. So instead he ends up with a 98 throw power, 99 throw short, 99 throw mid, and 99 throw deep. So pretty much you have two options here. Would you rather have 99 throw power and the 98 throw short and throw mid, or would you rather have 99 throw power and the 98 throw short and throw mid, or vice versa, I should say, 98 and the 99s. Comes down to that, but pretty much gonna be all maxed out. Get a 99 everything, gonna get escape artist, probably human joystick, and a few other things. Escape artist, human joystick, gunslinger, dashing deadeye. Car is going to be absolutely insane. Going to be the best quarterback in Madden. He's going to be glitchy. You do not want to go up against this Lamar Jackson because you will more than likely lose. He's going to be he's going to be a weapon, all right. That's not going to be fun to play against. And then coming into the final golden ticket, we got Trey Edmonds, 99 overall, halfback for the Steelers. Now he's six foot two, 98 speed, 98 excel, so he's super fast. 93 agility, 97 carrying, 74 catching, 99 elusiveness, 99 trucking, and 99 break tackle. Now this card overall. Gonna have 99 speed, 99 excel, 99 carrying, 99 tackle, now we'll break tackle, 99 trucking, 99 looseness. All he really lacks is agility, which means he probably won't get human joystick, but he is an evasive back, so he's gonna get some pretty good abilities, as well as some receiving abilities. So he's gonna be able to get maybe like hot route or whatever it is, like halfback apprentice or whatever. So he's gonna be able to run some pretty cool routes up the backfield. Gonna get probably evasive as well as some like bruiser or bulldozer. This card's pretty good actually. Not gonna lie, now why buy it? Probably gonna be too expensive for my liking, considering, you know, he is a golden ticket and he doesn't seem like someone I really want, but still looks super, super good. So those are today's golden tickets. We got Trey Edmonds, Lamar Jackson, Taylor Mays. Now for my weekly ranking, coming in number three, Trey Edmonds, in my opinion, like he's good, but like, do I really need him? No. Coming in number two, Taylor Mays, game breaking, such an amazing safety. Gonna be the best safety probably in Madden. 
for the rest of the year, quite honestly. And the number one's got to be Lamar Jackson. He's just, this card's crazy, really cool looking card art. I think that's, if I'm not mistaken, that should be the Blitz card art, right? I think. But this card looks just crazy. It, it looks amazing. I'm super excited to see if I can get my hands on him. I imagine probably like six mil if I can ever find him for about four mil. Be, be a pretty good pickup. Now let's go check out some of the draft expansion stuff. Okay, right, guys, so one of the first cards is 94 Ross Blacklock. Now this is the defensive tackle, pick 40 for the Texans second rounder. So this card looks, you know, not, nothing great. Decent finesse, decent block shed, decent athleticism. Decent card overall, but this is pretty much what you're looking at, just a 94. It's going to be great for theme teams, guys. Like, a real good theme team edition here. Marlon Davidson, same thing. Now, this, this defensive tackle, pick 47 for the Falcons, actually really good. Decent athleticism again, but high, mid, uh, low 90 tackle, above 90 block shit, and power move, which means he's a threshold kind of guy. Grant Delpit, safety for the Browns, great for a Browns theme team. Going to have great speed, 93. Great play rec 94, great hit power 94, and his zone and man should become pretty good with chems and on a theme team. Next, we got Yatir, uh, Yatir Gross Matos, I think. I don't know. I'm showing you guys him for card art. I do have a picture of his stats next, but this is just how the card art's kind of looking. Very similar to all the other stuff. And remember, the early second rounders will be 94, and then so on and so forth, 93, 92, 91, 90. He is uh, pretty good, pretty fast, decent block shedding, good finesse move. Guys, these are just some great theme team guys. Honestly, like I don't think I'd, you know, obviously we're not going to use them on our teams. But if you're rocking a theme team, you can't really go wrong with adding some draft cards. Going to be fun to play with, going to get booted. They can't be powered up, remember that. They cannot be powered up, but they will get some pretty good boost from being on a theme team, as well as just some, they're already nice cards to begin with. Next, we got T. Higgins, wide receiver for the Cincinnati Bengals. Pick 33, which means he was the first pick of the second round, I believe. So that is a 92 speed, 95 jumping. So on a theme team, he should end up with like, with theme team and everything, he should end up somewhere near like a 95 speed, 94 speed. Not bad, decent route running, great catching quite honestly. So this T Higgins card could be pretty good. Any six foot four, so you're gonna get a height guy on a Bengals theme team with Joe Burrow. You could probably make a pretty decent Bengals theme team. Pretty decent. I know they have probably a pretty decent line with, uh, they're gonna get Munoz, they get T Higgins, they get Burrow. I really don't know AJ Green, Tyler Boyd, Eifert. We got a pretty decent offense. Mixon, um, Dylan, pretty decent. Next we got Cole Komet, six foot six, 94 overall tight end for the Bears. Pretty fast for a tight end on a theme team. Could be pretty good and some great catching. Then we got Xavier McKinney, which is my guy from the Giants. Free safety, 92 speed, 94 excel. Giants team gonna get 95 speed. Gonna get a good play rec. Gonna have good hit power and good man coverage, which is actually kind of important if you're a blitzer. If you're blitzing a lot, you could toss him up in a man. He'll man up the wall running back which is super important in my opinion because when you can't man up a running back, that's pretty much where things go wrong when the running back can just run routes out of the backfield on man blitzes and they just get loose all the time. And when you sit in man, it usually stops that, but it only slows them down. If they if they play the route right or they play make for him, you, you're just lost in the sauce, I'm telling you guys. Next, we got wide receiver 94 over for the Jacksonville Jaguars. And we do have LaVisca Chenault Jr. 93 speed, he's 6 foot 1, which isn't bad. 93 speed, good catching, bad route running pretty much in my opinion. I don't think that's a guy for me. That route running is a little too low at this point in the game. We got DeAndre Swift, which is actually one of the cooler ones. 93 speed, 94 excel. Doesn't have great carrying or anything else, but he has got a jelly good speed. Kind of reminds me of a Jarek McKinnon build. Really tiny. Jonathan Taylor is probably the best one though. 95 speed at halfback, 96 uh, acceleration. For a cold steam team, he's going to have a 99 speed as 94 overall. Could be a very great budget back on a cold steam team. And then we got Anton Winfield Jr. is the last screenshot I took. 94 speed, 90 zone. Going to be great on a Buccaneers team, which can be pretty built right now with Gronkowski with, which again, for Gronk, you're going to have to get a certain card. as you know, very specific. Maybe the Madden Club Championship one or going all the way back to Christmas. But anyways, you're going to be able to get a pretty decent Bucks team at this point. But guys, it's about it for the video. Let's head back over to the Madden screen. Video, hope you guys did enjoy today's video. If you are new to the channel, make sure you're down below. Hit that subscribe button. Turn that notification bell, boys. Don't forget to comment down below. Let me know who your rankings of today's golden tickets are. Who's your favorite? Who's your least favorite? And personally, like I said, I'm going Trey Edmonds, then Mays, then Lamar Jackson. Now, personally, guys, I, th I think that the servers still just are, are off. It. They're iffy right now. So we're going to have to be getting these golden tickets for a little bit. It's possible we don't see them to at least like, possibly we don't see them for an hour, but it's also possible we don't see them until mid-afternoon, noon time. So don't expect them up anytime soon. Not like you guys probably would pull them anyways. They're very rare. So don't, you know. Don't go crazy about this. They're just kind of, they're, they're like, these are just formalities at this point. Like, oh, golden tickets. But like, I know I'm not going to pull one. I'm just hoping that Lamar gets to a decent enough price I can afford. But guys, about it. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I'm out. Peace.